I'm Big Ben, and welcome to this week's episode of Equip Tips, where we're going to be talking about reflectors. Let's talk a little bit about reflectors, and particularly this reflector. This is probably one of my favorite reflectors that I use both in my still photography as well as my video and cinematography applications. Reflectors are one of these great things that you can use with any apparent light source that you have, whether you're outside with the sun or inside with a bright enough light, to go ahead and reflect or bounce light into a subject's face. Now sometimes you might be shooting natural light photography and you need just enough of a fill light in their eyes to give them that catch light. You know, you don't want to use your pop-up flash. Reflector is a good alternative. One of the key things about a reflector that I think everyone should know is that it's really good to have an assistant with you when you're using one of these. Because as the sun moves, as your apparent light source changes and moves around, you're constantly going to have to adjust your light to where you want it to be. So what if you're a guy like me and you don't always have a voice activated light stand to hold this for you? Well, they do make something really cool. And that is a reflector holder. And all this is is a stick with a couple with a couple grommets on here where you can mount your reflector safely. Just like this. And it, it, it telescopes out to whatever size you need it to go. Tighten it down. And remember, if we're being safe, we're going to put sandbags on our light stand, right? We've talked about that. And now I have a reflector holder that I can adjust and move to wherever I need it to go. So if I don't have someone to hold this and I'm not outside on a windy day, I can easily set this up and now I can be free to be shooting. So most of you probably know this. This was pretty rudimentary. But now let's talk about what's so cool about this reflector. And this one is from Photoflex and it's called the Multidisc. And what I like about the Multidisc that it offers us five different surfaces in one package. That means that I have to pack around one-fifth as much equipment as I normally would. I don't have to carry my gold. I don't have to carry my white diffusion panel. I don't have to carry my silver reflector. I literally have all those in this one reflector. Let me show you how it works. As you see on the outside of this, uh, we have a silver surface, we have a soft gold surface, and the soft gold, if you get in real close here, you can see that we have silver, mostly a silver surface, but then we have little tiny zigzag inlays of gold. And what this does is it kind of gives us that mixed, mixed, mixed warmth look. So, because a lot of times a gold disc is way too warm and a lot of times a silver disc is way too contrasty and too cold. And what's good about the soft gold is that you have that option to where you can get a little bit of both light. Now for the fun part. We're going to undress this thing. The multi-disc from Photoflex actually unzips entirely to reveal your other three surfaces. The core of the system is a white diffusion panel which is great especially if you got a bright sunlight and you need to block some light from you know block light from the sun which works great and the inner two surfaces or should I say the other two surfaces is a white and a gold so you can see how you have your your silver and your soft gold flip it inside out and now you have a white reflection a right reflector and a gold reflector and they simply zip right back on how we took them off And this has saved me a lot of time in my workflow as a photographer, especially when I'm outside and need a quick, a quick uh, fill light or a quick kicker just to fill into someone's face or to fill them, you know, to give a catch light in the eyes to get rid of those deep sockets that we get during the noonday sun. Now that our reflector has been dressed, you can see now that we have a white and we have a gold panel. And honestly, I, rare, I rarely use the gold, but the white is an awesome one to use, especially in bright sunlight. I tend to use this 
probably the white more than anything. On a side note, one of the downfalls of reflectors is that we are limited to we are limited to the the quality and quantity of our apparent light source. If it's a really overcast day, I'm really not going to have enough light to really bounce this into someone's face. And in that case, that's when we are going to have to use an artificial lighting source. So, the other good thing about this, they quickly fold up into a tiny, a tiny disc, roughly about 15 inches. They can go in the trunk of your car. If you're one of those photographers that doesn't have a big truck and doesn't have a trailer to haul your stuff around, these are great. Again, this is the 5-in-1 multi-disc from Photoflex. We love this thing. I use it in my workflow daily and it's rugged it's durable it fits on our on our umbrella our reflector holders really well and i recommend this for anyone that owns a dslr camera and is going to be shooting subjects i'm big ben with equip tips and join us again next week as we go swimming in more of your questions and geeky stuff pertaining to the scientific attributes of photography i bid you happy shooting <laughs>